Yo, hi guys, Kevin here. Welcome back to my Minecraft world. It's been an amazingly long time since I've made my last episode of this. And to be honest, I've just been streaming this game. I haven't been doing um, episodes. I've just been streaming, um, doing changes to this world. Uh, so if you do follow me on Twitch, you will see some of the changes that I am going to share. Share? That I am going to show um, right now, but... Let's get straight into it. You can probably see a track over there, uh, but that's not really, not really a change. Um, down here, automatic wheat farm. I don't really know how this is running at the moment uh, because it hasn't, it hasn't been too long um, since this was actually built, so it hasn't accumulated anything yet. But in the future, it might start accum accumulating a little bit more. Uh, but let's take out the seeds and put those in there. And yeah, there's a lot of redstone under here, if you could probably see through there. Um, it's really complicated to follow, follow the tutorial basically. And yeah, it, was, it was simple in terms of following a tutorial, but yeah, it, it was, it's very, very, very complicated. So I'm going to show you what this is to the side as well. Um, we have got a cow farm here. Um, all the, all the stuff. Um, the stuck. Wow, why can't I speak? Um, all the cooked steak go into uh, this chest here. And we just collect it out and eat it. So, up here, I just made some stairs on the side. Uh, just There's cows bobbing around in here. You just breed them up. And they get pushed down. You'll see them coming around here in a second. There they are. They get pushed down into a hole. That pushes them across. And because um, of this Minecraft version... Um, they're attracted to their mother, I think it is. Um, so they try and stand next to their mother, which in turn uh, puts them right underneath them. So they stand right underneath, and when they grow up, they go into that lava right there. And when they're in the lava, they cook, and then all the stuff goes into here and pushes down into the chest. So very simple design, but that's that. Um, over here, we just got an automatic uh, sugar farm. It's not the most efficient, but we don't really need sugarcane, um, so it's efficient for what we need. Um, over here is what I was working on last. I don't know if I got it finished or not. Um, I got it kind of finished. It's not, it's not fully finished, um, but basically, it's just a, it's a stable. Uh, because I'm going to get some horses from over here in my thing over there uh, put them into there because uh, they were really annoying me being in there so yeah that's that of this area I suppose uh, we automated quite a bit of it which is good uh, aut automation is good um, I exploded this area with a creeper but accidentally um, also a new chest room a little bit more organized I left a gap here for um, like a brewing room in the future uh, but for now we're gonna stick with what we've got uh, let me dump some of, the, some of this stuff here uh, seeing as I am coming through um, let's put all my junk in here to keep the arrows um, books I should have dropped them down by the enchantment table um, we can put them in there. Is that the food? Is that food? Yeah, food. Nope. Um, wood we could dump off in there. Um, stone can go in there. That's like a mixture of cobblestone, stone, and stuff like that. Uh, pretty similar items, so I don't mind them being mixed together. All the dirt can go in there too. Feather Falling 4 on a book. That was a very good book. Can't remember getting that, but. Yeah, we got it. So we could put Feather Falling, Depth Strider, and Unbreaking Free on boots. Yeah. That will be some sick boots right there. Um, so I've got some sand right up here. Yeah. Okay, so let's dump the sand in there. Uh, that's pretty much everything. i uh, got some OP spade. Look at this. What? Look at that spade. Just, just look at it. Okay, so that's that. Um, in terms of the house, it hasn't changed much. I just changed this because this used to be a trap door over there. Um, I just changed it to some stairs. It's a little bit easier to get down. There's a wizard out there. Um, how many diamonds do we have now? Uh, we've only got nine diamonds, so we will have to go on a mining hype soon. 
Uh, but for now, I'm just going to jump into bed over here. And get our sleep on. Get our sleep on. Um, and let's head over to probably my main build, or most complicated build, let's say. Um, should we ride a horse out? Nah, let's just run. It's quicker. Um, is this wizard still over here? Yes. Never, never actually killed a wizard yet. Yeah, I killed one. Swag. What does it drop? Sugar. <laughs> really? Really, bro? Okay, so this track here was to transport a villager to that automa automatic farm. But to get villagers, um, I had to kind of make a villager farm. Um, so that is where this track leads to. Um, I built it away because apparently you have to build it away from like your house or something. Because uh, they get um, stuck with doors or the doors interact with them somehow. Um, this is like a chamber for when uh, they actually it actually works. Which, to be honest, I haven't really been online. So it hasn't really worked. But that is just because I haven't been online. Um, let's jump up here. What the fuck was that sound? Did you just hear that sound? That was like someone was dying. It's like, oh! <sighs> Maybe it was that guy who was loved up. He was like orgasming or something. But I have no idea. But yeah, we got some villagers over here. And we cordoned them, cordoned them off. Uh, basically, when there's babies down here, they have the chance to fall down in that corner. Um, there's a trap door, so they think it's a solid block. Uh, they step on it and they fall down the hole so that's that um, I just want to see what that guy I don't know what that sound was was there someone dying or was it, is that the love sound they make I don't know um, <laughs> pretty weird sound to be honest but we could deal with it um, but yeah that's that's pretty much all the stuff I built on stream um, so if you don't follow me on Twitch, I reckon you do, do follow me on there. Um, I stream a lot of FIFA, I stream a lot of um, Minecraft on there. So check that, check that, check that out. So that's them. we got three farmers in there. Um, to be honest, I don't really see me using villagers too much at the moment. Uh, I'll probably build like a trading place soon. Uh, but for now, I don't really see the need. Uh, so I'm just going to let them breed up and start storing up. Uh, so that's pretty much all the builds um, right there. Yeah, that's pretty much it, actually. I was trying to think if there's any more, but no, I don't think there is. Um, this this has got to come down. It's, it's just not efficient at all. It's terrible. It's the worst spawner I've ever built, and it just doesn't work. It's terrible. <laughs> that's just pretty much summed up. It is terrible. Um, so... That is the pig, um, the cows right there. Uh, but what I want to do is work on a bit of the farm. I want to get like the floor done uh, because obviously the floor, the floor is just like a little bit bland. Um, if you get what I mean, um, I kind of want to make it a little bit more, a little bit more vibrant in here. So I think I'm just going to go with a stone brick on the floor and leave grass in those sections there. Um, and I think that will work pretty, pretty well. What we could do is line it with the... Oh my god. I didn't know there was holes. Um, what we could do is line it with um, wood. Be an interesting thing to do. Um, and then put stone across like the very middle. That could look pretty good. Um, yeah, I think, that'll, I think that'll go pretty well. Um, so let's go... Just dig out this section here, and then I'm gonna go grab some woods, woods, and I'll grab some stone brick as well. Um, I might as well just dig out this because that's where the stone bricks gonna go. And then I think the horses could pretty much go in here. Uh, I think it's just gonna be an open stable. Um, I'm gonna get like fences across here um, because. Putting them in these little sections here, um, when they're stuck in here, you're going to jump on them and your head's going to go through the ceiling so you'll start dying. 
Um, so I'm just going to keep it like kind of open, open planned. <laughs> yeah, an open planned stable. Who would have thought? Um, so let me grab some stone and some wood. Unfortunately, we don't have any wood. We have no stone brick either. So let's head to our chest room. And to be honest, this this kind of area, I don't use it. Um, I don't know what to do with it really because I don't really take boats out and I don't see the need to take boats out. Um, so I don't know. I don't, I don't know. What what do you guys think I should do with that area? Uh, because the boat thing is just not it's not very good, is it? <laughs> I just don't use it to what I was what I thought I was going to use it. Um, so let's grab some stone bricks out of there and let's head back down here and get our build on. Hopefully 36 stone brick is enough. I just thinking about it, I don't think it's enough, but we could just go grab some more afterwards. Um, pretty simple. Uh, so let's head over here to the stable. Uh, it's good to have like a, my horses in a certain area. Uh, because they they were just roaming about um, in my in my enchantment room, so they're getting kind of annoying in there. There's jumping around and all sorts. Um, so in here, they should be a little bit more chilled out, hopefully. Um, but yeah, I don't think I've got enough stone brick. Um, seeing as I've got eight, no, I don't know. Yeah, I got more than enough. Yeah, easy. Okay, so that's the floor. Yeah, that that works all right. Um, and then if I get fences there. Uh, they make three fence gates in a row. I think that'll work pretty much spot on. So, I think they've changed the recipe for fence gates, actually. Uh, I did see I had some fences in here. Uh, but a fence gate... It's going to be a random guess. No, don't you have to put... Then you have to put the fences in nowadays. What am I doing? No, it's not like that. I'm sure you have to get the uh, the fences involved somehow. What have I done? No, maybe not. Um. <laughs> um. Let me just have a quick, quick look how to do it. Okay, I didn't really Google it very well. I just typed in fence gate and a pub came up. Um, so, <laughs> um, no, it is the same. It's should be sticks like that, and then those in the middle. Yeah, it's still the same. Don't know why I thought it changed. Pretty weird. Yeah, so let's make three of these. There we go. I could already hear the horses jumping behind me. Like, why you do this? Why? Why would you jump there? Just stand still and do nothing, please. Okay, so let's jump over here and let's chuck on the fence gates. Um, should I make pressure plates on the outside? I think I should actually. It'd be a little bit easier with the horses. So if I put like fence gates there, uh, pressure plates. Sorry. Oh no, I need three. <laughs> I was like, is one gonna work all those? Nope. So let's jump three of those there. And then the horses should be all sorted to come over here now. So let's get this out of the way. And yeah, that works, that works. So I kinda like that design of the of the stable there. It looks pretty sick. So let's go grab our horses. Let's grab the horses, the horses, horses, horses. So let's put all the wood in there, just so we got wood for next time. Uh, fences can go in there too. And let's grab more horses then. This guy just loves to come in that area. Like, it's always a always a bugger to get in and out of this place as well. So, be a little bit easier in this one. There we go, straight in, jump off, and that is that. So. One thing I do have to find is some horse armor because these guys are looking really naked. Uh, we gotta get some armor around here. 
So let's jump on my, my white beast. Um, how did he get here? Okay, like that. <laughs> Open. And yeah, this guy's pretty fast. Um, I can't remember if he jumps very high, but his health... This guy's health is the highest. His health is just insane. But this guy's got more speed, so... Nice mixture there. Uh, we can get those breeding as well. Um, I don't know how you breed horses. I'll look that up before but yeah nice little stable going on right now I like this I like this um, so yeah I think this is going to be about it for this episode um, we got the stable finished off there um, it looks pretty nice with that flooring um, we got the horses roaming around in there now so that's pretty sick um, I showed you all the builds around here um, they all pretty much work pretty solid um, got to see if this works very efficiently efficiently uh, but I think it's a pretty slow wheat farm uh, but we could deal with that um, in a later time uh, but yeah I hope you guys enjoyed this if you did give it a thumbs up um, follow me on twitch because I do live stream in this I do live stream this quite often so do follow me on twitch if you enjoyed this and yeah I'll see you guys next time